Michael, thanks for the like, buddy. Jump back in to the old Hogwarts legacy. Part two. Yeah. With a little bit of cam, cam action, baby. Oh, yeah. Oh, let's see. Where did we leave off last time? <laughs> let's just see. Shall we? Oh, yeah, we made it this far. We're into the castle. Now we need to leave, leave here. Go to the common area, I do believe. Yeah. Just push the door open, why don't you? Basically my first time playing through, so <laughs> this should be interesting. I suppose some introductions are in order. Hmm. Do we have to? One moment. Watch this. Maybe we do. He, he threw a stink bomb. That wasn't quite the reaction I wanted. <laughs> That's funny. Oh well. Right. What did you hope would happen? I suppose I hoped it would lighten the mood. Ravenclaws can be a bit on edge the first day of class. I'm Everett, by the way. You seem downright calm next to some of these characters. And you survived a rather harrowing trip here. I'm looking forward to my first day. I'm actually a tad nervous. Harrowing indeed. I'm still a bit on edge myself and a Must little, be a little naive. Start. Sure. Oh, you needn't be worried. Truly, there's no reason to be nervous. Most professors are firm, but fair. I mean, not all of the tricks I play are as simple as a tossed dung bomb, and I'm still here. Wait, did you say most professors are firm, but fair? Ha, <laughs> I did. But probably best I let you judge for yourself. I do tend to push their limits. I should wander off before someone traces that dung bong back to me. Nice meeting you. You too, Everett. His name was Everett, and he dropped a dung bomb. Scared people away. He's talking shit already. That's all they do is talk the shit. Sometimes the prefect sits next to me. Must be different. Starting Hogwarts in the fifth year. Oh, listen to that. Straight up shit talking. Not even caring that we listen. I want to be in the perfect place. A place he'll be happy with. But I can't seem to find it. Great golden gobstones. I want him to thrive here. Golden gobstones? <laughs> My own little expression. I bought this Dittany seedling from home and I so want him to feel cozy. Dittany is amazing, isn't it? So much healing power in such a little plant. <laughs> I've a bit of a thing for plants, as you can see. <laughs> she does. Pleased to meet you. I'm Samantha. Nice to meet you, Samantha. Is Dittany used in Wiganwell potion? It is. Looks like someone's been studying up on their potion making. Actually, Professor Fig told me about the Wigan World potion. Of course. I heard you were studying with him before term. He's an enigma, Fig. Teaches about theory. It seems to know a lot about practical magic. A little bit. He's quite knowledgeable. Professor Fig does know a great deal about, um, different forms of magic. Well, I hope he told you about more than Wig and Weld. You've lots to catch up on, I'm sure. Isn't he a Hufflepuff who likes plants? Do we want to continue the conversation? 
Is it common practice for students to grow their own ingredients? Oh, yes. In fact, our herbology teacher, Professor Garlic, encourages it. And I don't think Professor Sharp, our potions master, cares where you get your ingredients, as long as your brews are all perfect. An affinity for herbology is more typical of a Hufflepuff than a Ravenclaw, isn't it? Ordinarily, perhaps. But it runs in my family. We've a full plot of these little fellows back home. I suppose you could say herbology is in my roots. But you should be a Hufflepuff. It was nice to meet you, Samantha. Good luck with your ditany. Thank you. And good luck to you too on your first day. Might as well eat an apple. Ian's were here. There's only one common one that everyone wishes they could get in. That's Hufflepuff. That's just brilliant, Ami. Brilliant. You'd think you could... Ah! That is not how that... Guess we have I to have meet not... our classmates before we can do anything. Up. Can't see too much in the day. Well, except for stars like Sirius, Canopus, Vega, and Arcturus. I'm Amit. Pleasure to have you in Ravenclaw. Never met someone who's been so close to a dragon before. Can't say I'd recommend it, frankly. It's nice to meet you, Amit. I take it you like astronomy. Oh, yes. So much to be learned from the stars. Also, there's something about the open air and night sky above the tower. It's invigorating. You will adore astronomy. Professor Shaw is incredibly knowledgeable. Wonder what he does up there. I'm afraid I'm not much for memorizing constellations. Enough to worry about on the ground. Well, you should know that all fifth years must take astronomy. However, I think you will feel differently after one night up on the tower. A quality telescope can show you things you never dreamed of. I suppose I'll see you in class then. Yes. Oh, and speaking of class, better get to my first one of the year. Nothing like the smell of fresh parchment, is there? Be seeing you. Be seeing you. <laughs> hey there, new Ravenclaw. Professor Weasley is looking for you just outside. You had best not keep her waiting. I suppose. We can't explore, we gotta go I suspect most of the are talk to people. What is this? I told myself I was gonna get lost in the scenery. <laughs> and I just did. I suppose we gotta go downstairs. morning i trust you're ready for your first day at hogwarts i've been dreaming of this day for a long time i can't believe i'm here well you are here make the most of it you only have one first day at hogwarts now in light of your unique situation joining us as a fifth year you'll need to catch up with your classmates and not fall behind especially as you'll be expected to complete your owls at the end of the year owls owls Yes, your ordinary wizarding level exams. They will determine what type of career you can have when you leave here. After much discussion with the headmaster and the Department of Magical Education at the Ministry, we've devised something extraordinary to ensure your success. Here you are. What is it? It is a wizard's field guide. It will help you to keep track of what you are learning so that you master all that's expected of a fifth year. You would be wise to take full advantage of this exceptionally valuable resource. Oh, so she thinks so, huh? Never know, though. Thank you, Professor, but what do you mean it will keep track of what I'm learning? Perhaps seeing it in action will answer any questions you may have. She wants us to catch some papers. Here's our true test. This way. The 
The guide will give you opportunities to practice your magic and educate yourself about wizarding lore. That's what we need to do. Educate ourselves. I certainly would have appreciated something like the field guide when I was a student. Yes, to me too. Why don't you cast Revelio on this bust and see what details the field guide can provide? Revelio. You just unlocked the field guide challenge. Your progression towards completing challenges appears here. Click field guide pages in Hogwarts 1 or 2. Escape. Okay. So it's like a menu screen. Gotcha. So we have all of our stuff right there. <clears throat> your field guide task your current challenge progression select the challenges menu to continue field guide pages one percent overall progression one percent okay Oh. Clever, isn't it? Keep your eyes open for more opportunities like Clever. that inside and outside of the castle. Totally. No time to waste. You've classes to attend. She was like, come on, let's go. Go getting distracted. I got things to show you. Ah, good timing. Perfect opportunity to show you how to use flu flames to get around a bit quicker. Your field guide contains a map of the castle. Open it up and find Central Hall. Hogwarts is invited to main areas. The left of the map is where students and professors live. They include a house, common rooms, and a great hall. The right side of the map is where you find academic points and interest, including the astronomy tower, library, and greenhouses. Library. The only place I can go to you. Zoom. Rotate. Okay. I don't know if I was supposed to quick travel there or not, but I did. And here we are. Quite the time saver. These stairs lead directly to Central Hall. You can get almost anywhere in the castle quickly from Central Hall. Always something happening here. It's the heart of the hive. Our King's Cross Station, so to speak. I hope I'm wealthy enough one day to see everything. That should be all for now. 
You'll be expected to attend both Charms and Defense Against the Dark Arts classes today. And I'd like to be sure you get to Hogsmeade as soon as possible to replace the supplies you lost on the way here. You mentioned Hogsmeade, Professor. <coughs> Hogsmeade is the only all-wizarding village in Britain and is home to an array <coughs> of and pubs. You should be able to find all of the school supplies you require in Hogsmeade. You will also, I imagine, enjoy many a butterbeer there with friends in due course. Butterbeer. <clears throat> what will I learn in charms class? Exactly what you might expect. Spells, charms, jinxes. All terribly useful. I think you will enjoy Professor Ronan. He's a clever and entertaining wizard. And a talented teacher. Jinxes. What the heck? Can you tell me more about the Defense Against the Dark Arts class? Defense Against the Dark Arts, as the name implies, focuses on how to defend oneself against the evils that lurk beyond these walls. A mastery of Defense Against the Dark Arts is required for those who aspire to become Auras. Fortunately, we are lucky to have the ever-gifted Professor Hecate in charge of our students' education in that regard. All right, we learned everything Thank we you, need Professor to learn. Weasley. A lot to absorb on your first day. Yes. And you have much to learn. Happily, yes. your yes, professors have agreed to create additional assignments for you outside of class. You'll be up to speed in no time. Judging by your adept use of Revelio earlier, I'd say Professor Fig succeeded in at least showing you the basics. He did, Professor. He's been terribly vague as to the events preceding your arrival, specifically about what happened after that awful dragon attack. My suspicion is that there's more to the story than a search for belongings and an extended trip up to the castle. We did take a bit of a detour on the way here. Ended up exploring some ruins and... I shouldn't say more. Exploring ruins? Well, I presume Professor Fig has his reasons for keeping the details to himself for now. For now. Speak of the devil, Professor Fig. Your ears must have been burning. Oh? Yes. You seem to have provided our new fifth year with a solid foundation in the basics of spellcasting. Ah, I'm afraid I can't take all the credit there, Professor. They've a rare aptitude for magic it seems hmm well i'm just glad you both arrived in one piece perfectly good boats and carriages to hogwarts and you chose to fly in the path of a dragon i wouldn't say i chose the dragon's path professor rather unfortunately it would seem that it chose us very well enough chit chat i need to get to class myself might i rely on you professor fig to explain the details of the field guide's map of course. Thank you. Thank you, she says. Good luck today. And remember to use your field guide. It will be invaluable to you. And invaluable to me, as I'll be using it to keep up to date on your progress. Yes, Professor. Come and find me in my classroom after you've attended both classes today, and I'll explain more about those assignments I mentioned. And we'll see if we right. can't get you to Hogsmeade for those supplies. My character is such easy to please. <laughs> He's an easy pleaser. All right. Let's talk to the old fig It's here. good to see you, Professor. And you. I was hoping our paths would cross today before you immersed yourself in studies. Did I hear you and Professor Weasley talking about exploring ruins? Yes. She caught me off guard. I didn't tell her anything else about our travels here. I will say, I think she suspects we're not being entirely forthcoming. Yes, well, Professor Weasley is a brilliant and astute witch. It was right to keep the details to yourself for now. We don't know Burning. where this path we've embarked upon will lead. It may require a bit more flexibility with your time than she would approve of. 
and she may feel obliged to share details with the headmaster that would be better left between us. Understood, Professor. Good. Now, as capable as you are, I believe the ability you possess obliges you to be well-trained. Happily, you have the benefit of an exceptionally skilled team of witches and wizards to guide you. Speaking of guides, and so that I may avoid another not-so-subtle reproof from Professor Weasley, why don't I show you the clever enchantment we included in the field guides map? Unfold it and have a look. Main quests, okay. Complete a main quest will further the story, unlock new features, and grant XP. Some quests are locked by spell and or level requirements. In these cases, you will need to be required level and or required spell to activate the quest. New spells can be earned by clean professor's assignment or as quest rewards. Could you? Track a quest. The map is enchanted to help you find your way. This will be incredibly helpful. Thank you. Now, sounds like you've quite a day ahead, what with classes and a trip to Hogsmeade for supplies, including your own wand. You'll enjoy Mr. Ollivander. He's an exceptional craftsman and a good friend. I shall reach out when I have more information about our mysterious locket. For now, focus on your classes and pay attention. More than your owls may hinge on the magic you are able to master within these walls. Yeah. Quest complete. Charm compass. Cast Charm Compass V. The Charm Compass will lead you to anything that you're tracking. Field Guide Map shows Professor Hecate's classes in the lower section of the economy. We could get lost in this castle and may need to use the Charm Compass V to the Field Guide to help me find the way. Hmm. Side quests are now available. Available side quests can be found inside regions of Hall where it's marked as play. And discovered by exploring the world. These quests reward XP but do not advance the main story. Of course they don't. They're side quests. So we're going here. We can on track it. It looks like our reward is Lovioso. Assisio. Okay. Follow the, the dust trail. Oh, oh, oh. Nice warm. All kinds of crazy stuff going on around here. Uh oh, we're into the quest. be good enough to blast each other to pieces on your own time. I get new students every year, but I only have one Hebridean black skull. It was a token from the great poacher raid of 1878. No doubt you've heard of it. Now, you may be asking yourself how an old woman like me single-handedly took out the largest poacher ring in eastern Wales and lived to boast about it. 
knowledge. To the wise, age matters very little. Today we will review a spell that has saved me from death at the hands of dark wizards more times than I care to remember. Levioso. Levioso? A levitation charm? Levioso! A surprised opponent is a weak opponent. Care to defend yourself, Master Pruitt? No? One thing I've learned as an unspeakable is the value of simplicity, especially in the heat of battle. Now, let's practice what we've just learned, starting with something small. Something small. Steady your wand. Space, 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 space. Okay. Ah, oh, crap. It's gonna be a little tricky with a mouse. It was tricky. But we got it. Levioso. Look at that. We've levitated a feather. Now, let's try something a little larger. Let us begin with a basic cast. Form a basic cast using your mouse. See how the dummy deflected your cast. This time, cast Levioso first, then the basic cast. Remember, good. well done. Very good, but the best way to practice is by dueling. We'll start with you two. Duelist, take your marks. Time for a proper Hogwarts welcome. Now, I want a fair duel using only Levioso, basic cast, and Protego. You may begin. Levioso, good for Protego. I know. You're good. How perceptive. Thank you. <laughs> what are you doing up there? Remember the lesson. Levioso is quite effective in concert with other spells. Oh, you're good at this, aren't you? Tego. I know. Tego, stupefy. This can't be your first duel. Let's just say I'm a quick learner. Levioso. If only all of my students were I do enjoy a life of joy. Levioso. <laughs> that happens. Try to anticipate your opponent's next move. I did, I did. Not bad for a beginner. You give as good as you get. <laughs> We did good. I put you on the spot, and you rose to the challenge. Points to Ravenclaw. Thank you, Professor Hackett. Glad to have the opportunity to practice. If what I've seen today is any indication, we can expect great things from you. I demand excellence from my students. They are capable of achieving it, and they must achieve it. A classroom duel is one thing, but battling dark wizards, or as ever more likely, goblins, is a different kettle of Grindelows entirely. Understood, Professor. So, I'd advise you to keep practicing whenever you can. Perhaps Mr. Sallow will have some ideas for you. Again, well done today. I shall reach out soon with additional assignments. All right. That's enough spectacle for one day. Class is dismissed. She said class is dismissed.
Well, I guess we did one class. Now we got to nice make work. up for this guy. I enjoyed that. Well, that duel was quite something. Everyone will be talking about it. It was certainly good practice. Practice? It felt more like I was dueling an expert. Sebastian Sallo, by the way. Didn't expect a new student to be so deft with a wand. Then again, perhaps this wasn't your first duel. <coughs> I had my share of wand combat. Uh -huh. It was. Never used my wand in combat. In fact, it was. Perhaps I have a knack for it. Be coy if you like, but I know better. Magic requires <coughs> intention and talent. You didn't you know. believe me. Of course You not. might be a perfect fit for a certain exclusive, unsanctioned dueling organization. Sounds intriguing. Sounds suspicious. Unsanctioned? I don't know. School rules are in place for a reason. Yes, to keep students in the dark. So many things we're deemed unprepared to know. If you want to get the most out of your time at Hogwarts, you're going to need to break the rules now and then. Whether it's joining a secret dueling club or sneaking into the restricted section of the library, you just have to be clever enough not to get caught. Thank you, Don't Sebastian. Don't get caught. I'll keep that in mind. Good. Pleasure chatting with you. I'm sure I'll see you soon. Perhaps somewhere unsanctioned? We'll see if your performance today was sheer luck or actual skill. Look for Luke and Brattleby near the clock tower entrance. If you're interested. Till next time. Until next day. Well, I did learn Levioso. Levioso. Ooh, you're kind of cute. Huh. Always thought Levioso was for first years. Not anymore. I'd hate to face Professor Hecate in a duel. Hmm. Wouldn't we all? Handy resource indeed, your field guide. I'm most pleased to be included. <laughs> Well, let's get ourselves lost, shall we? Revelio. Guide pages. This is a skeleton of an Irish Sphinx. Hmm. Two or two. I like it. Collections, quests, charm class. We already talked to him. Charm class. F locate on me. Tapestries. Oh, did I miss it? It's a loo. Well, crapola. Hmm. 
Okay, you can flush the toilet. Love it. I've Professor Figgy. Travel broadens the mind. What is this? This be the ladies' room? No, you got urinals. <laughs> <coughs> Oh, I saw something. I did, I did. Professor Fig. As if my schedule wasn't congested enough, the ministry has charged me with the arranging the rather invalid arrival of new students at Hogwarts. Fifth year. You can't believe. Professor Wisely insists that they have. We'll need an escort, mentor, blah, blah, blah. Wonder who that was. Tyler's Blazer School uniform. Uh-oh. Got too close and broke. Apparently we don't need to speak to him at the moment. I've no doubt the flat will be remembered as the worst headmaster Hogwarts has ever seen. No ability to have a rapport with his pupils whatsoever. Can ease trap. People's conversation. Level locked. Hmm. It is locked. We can't do nothing with it. All right, I think we need to go up a little bit more. Professor Ronan tends to go on a bit. I we sometimes have to remind him to finish the lesson. I rather enjoy Some of us don't necessarily myself. want him to get back to the lesson. Begin. We begin. Here. Behind you. There is an open seat here. Thank you. Hello, I am Nettie. So you are the new student. Have you met Professor Ronan yet? <coughs> Shall we begin? <laughs> Welcome to year five of Charms. Now, this will be a crucial year in your education on the art of charm work, but I am confident that we will take hold with a passion and rigor requisite of such a challenge. Right, now, everyone, please open your textbooks to page 517. But before we begin, can anyone here tell me the difference between the incantations of the Color change and growth charms. Anyone? Anyone? Mm? No. Ah, 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 ah. I am afraid it is too late to study now. Hmm. 
My, the seven months must have really taken a toll on you all. <laughs> Please, uh, not it, today. You all spent your holidays practicing oblivion on one another. <laughs> uh, hmm. Do you even remember how to perform a basic summoning charm? Hmm? Hmm. Well, it seems that we are in dire need of review. Everyone get into pairs and take positions on opposite sides of the classroom. Now let's put those textbooks to use as the blunt objects you so believe they are, and take turns summoning them out of one another's hands. Only one book will be needed per partnership, Miss Dale. Thank you. Get into place now. Oh boy, we gotta learn another spell here. These are so much fun. Alright. That one wasn't so bad. Akio. Ekium. That is not bad. You are a swift learner. I see a lot of potential, but remember, potential is nothing without practice. Keep at it. You might just rival Miss Onai here. Very good, everyone. That's enough of that. Well, as Jeez, you all sweet see, we have the basics down, and it is an exceptionally lovely day. I was thinking that we might have ourselves a little excursion outside for a spot of fresh air. After Jesus, me. fresh air. It's all dusty inside. Let's go get some fresh air. The air is potent. <laughs> I've always found that fun goes hand in hand with mastery, as I'm sure the Quidditch players amongst us would agree. Hmm? <laughs> so, what better than a bit of sport to put our prowess with the summoning charm to the test, right? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Those are some big balls. So why don't we have our newest students start us And they're off? blue. <laughs> we got blue ball. Very simply, cast Accio on one of the spheres and relinquish your charm at the last possible moment. Now, uh, think of this like Goku, if you will. But instead, splendid! Happens to the best of us. Excellent, good. Stay focused. I released it. it. Very good. Don't lose your composure. <laughs> Very good. Points to Ravenclaw. But there's certainly no sport in playing without some friendly competition. Miss Onai, would you care to give our new student a bit of a challenge? Come on up. You'll be the blues, just as before, and Miss Onai, you are playing red. Clear? Yes, sir. Clear. Bisha. There we go. Oh, man. Akio. I win. To the best of us. What? That is how it's done. Okay. <laughs> Do not be discouraged. That's how it's done. All right, we got to get one and get at least some point. Not to worry. 
<laughs> Let us make this a bit more interesting, shall we? Oh boy. Gonna... <laughs> I think we are well past interesting at this point. I'll say. Enough chatter. Focus now. You will need it. This round settles it all. Be sharp. Uh oh. I see what they're doing here. Go. Okay. Akio. That is how it's done. Oops. Don't lose your composure. Watch this. Oh, I gotta get at least on the end. Okay. There we go. I win. Oh, no, I didn't. She got 10 points on me. Darn it all. Very good, both of you. Well done. Well done. <laughs> Very good. I think I might be. Gather your things on the way out. Well done back there. You took the loss in stride. Didn't want to go too easy on you. Took me weeks to become proficient with Akio. Took weeks for me to get anything right when I transferred here. It gets easier, I promise. I think that mouse pad will work better. I'm glad you understand. That's good to hear. It's a lot to take in all at once. To put it lightly, I remember how I felt when I first arrived. I transferred here from Wagadu just before my fourth year. My mother received an offer to teach divination here. Before I knew it, we had left Uganda and were halfway around the world at a new school in a new country. How big is Uganda? Is Wagadu much bigger than Hogwarts? <laughs> Wagadu School of Magic is the largest wizarding school in the world. So yes, bigger than Hogwarts. But it never seemed intimidating or overwhelming to me. It always felt like home. Is Wagadu a castle like Hogwarts? Its address is Mountains of the Moon. It is not so much a castle as a beautiful edifice carved out of the mountainside. Beautiful. I remember the first time I saw it, the mist was so thick I could hardly make out anything at all. And then it just materialized before me this enormous school that seemed to be teachers back there being a creeper <laughs> it's like it's nice to learn about y'all need to stop school. talking thank you for asking i do miss wagadu but i am glad to be here at hogwarts ah i think professor ronan wants to talk to you better not keep him waiting until next time until next time of course you can use Akio on humans. A word if, if you so would. Inclined. Let's do some you more talking, Jill. me, Professor. I did. I trust your first charms lesson lived up to expectation? Well, an outdoor competition wasn't exactly the lesson I was expecting, sir. What charm is there in the expected? Miss Onai is a talented witch. Take it in stride. One often gains the most from the battles one has lost. Of course, Professor. It was a challenging match. Miss Onai is always a fierce competitor, though I sense that she is a bit distracted of late. <clears throat> now, 
Professor Weasley has asked that your professors give you instruction outside of the ordinary curriculum. Expect to hear from me soon regarding a special assignment that I am preparing for you. Quest complete. The charms class. Ooh, we hit level two. We're high rolling now. Hello. Oh boy. How's your first day coming along? Hello, Samantha. Nice to see you again. I wondered how your first day was going. You certainly seem to hold your own in charms. <coughs> Thank you, but it really wasn't all that challenging. My brother William would tell you not to be so humble and to trust your abilities. Then again, he tends to be a bit overconfident in his. Well, better see to my charms homework. I find Professor Ronan's lessons a bit more challenging than you do. Bye-bye, Samantha. I tried to hide a puff from you once. And then the werewolves joined the goblins the in the outside. Werewolves, where were you? In the goblins. Accio. And by the end of this, the Minister for Magic... I saw that just out of the corner of my eye. Don't say my goodbyes. I shall cheer for the boy who says you're telling I'm lies. I'm not telling lies, Peeves. It was Albert Boot. No, it wasn't. It was Basil Flat. Ooh, fight, fight. It's a bold attack. That's was the shit. minister a boot or the minister a flack? Stop mm -hmm. it, Peeves. You'll get us in trouble. In trouble you will be, but you can't. How oh, nice to see you, my young. Weasley after class. Okay, let's go, Dana. There's a crate right here. Hmm. I'm under the stairs. Way down here. Down, down, down. Down, down, down. We're gonna get lost. Good thing for fast travel. Activate a new quick travel point. What about the room, Professor? Deke. I was thinking the same thing, Deke. Perhaps you could help. He's a goofy looking SOB, isn't he? <laughs> oh, uh, excuse, Deke. Ah, there you are. I trust your first classes went well? They did, Professor. I heard as much from Professors Hecate and Ronan. Seems Professor Fig taught you quite a bit during your brief detour near... What was it you said? Some ruins? I'd wager there's a good deal more to your travels here than what you've told me. Isn't there? Hasn't Professor Fig said anything? No, Professor. Nothing more, Professor. I see. Like trying to get a sonnet from a streeler. Regardless, you must continue to build upon what you've learned. In that regard, I've asked your professors to help hasten your progress with some extra assignments. I'm about to be a snitch. <laughs> Professor Ronan did mention something about that. In fact, Professor Ronan will meet you outside momentarily to assign your first one. Now, regarding the trip to Hogsmeade I mentioned earlier. We've arranged to replace the supplies lost on your way here, including seeds, potion recipes, and spellcrafts. 
Thank you, Professor. And Mr. Ollivander will connect you with the perfect wand. You've managed your classes well with a borrowed wand, but you'll find the magic you cast with your own wand to be far superior. I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. Very well. I'd like you to make your first visit to the village with a classmate. Help you get your bearings. Perhaps Sebastian Sallow or Natsai Onai. I've noticed you spending time with them. Hey, thanks for the follow. What's going on? Sorry, my dog jumped up behind me and made a big thud, so I had to see what was going on with the dog real quick. What is going on? How about that, Natty? Let's go with Natty. Excellent choice. Miss Onai is one of our most talented students. And she knows the area. She'll keep you well clear of any of Victor Rookwood's other Thanks for the follow, too. Route. Appreciate you, brother. Rookwood. A rather unsavory local. Best to avoid him and his associates, including his right hand of sorts, Theophilus Harlow, if you can. Once you've finished Professor Ronan's assignment, your friend will meet you at the castle doors. No time to waste. The sooner you complete your work, the sooner you can enjoy a butterbeer at the Three Broomsticks. Butterbeer. Speak to Professor Ronan to receive the first assignment. What ya dog doing? What we dog doing? We're playing uh, Hogwarts Legacy, man. That's what we're doing. What are you doing? Watching? Coming in saying hi? Alright. On to the nest. Oh, look, a kitty. I don't know what Madame Hagar was seeing in the Melder Rays. She's not that good at flying. It's a kitty cat. I think I'll go for a quick sprint on my broom after class tonight. I find it okay, back on task. Time. Getting distracted. Ah, there you are. Professor Rowan. You have a new spell to teach me, Professor. Indeed I do, and an exceedingly useful one at that. The mending charm, Repero. Fixes Repello. things right up, makes a broken object good as new in the blink of an eye. Hmm. It seems as if that might come in handy. More frequently than one would imagine. As Professor Weasley mentioned, I am not the only one who will be teaching you spells outside of class in an effort to catch you up with your peers. A number of your professors have agreed to do so as well, but first, each shall ask that you complete a few preliminary tasks to hone your magic. I have Only arranged the some for today. See them through and then report back to me. <laughs> we will have you casting Rapero in no time. I'll complete the tasks. I'll start on the task right away, Professor. Professor, 
Oops. Why must I complete these tasks? They are meant to give you first-hand experience as you proceed to master new bits of magic. Good luck, and I shall see you soon. Professor, well, I did it again. why must I complete these tasks? They are meant to give you first-hand experience. Good luck, and I shall see you soon. Okay. Seems that we repeated ourselves a hundred times. This is the right area. I wonder where the flying page is. Oh, there it is. Well, we got one. A flying page must be around here somewhere. Got you. You slimy little booger. I trust the preliminary tasks weren't. I completed the assignments, Professor. Marvelous. We completed. You clearly it. know your way around basic charms. Let us give the old mending charm a try then, shall we? Remember to be deliberate in your enunciation and movements. I want to see some vigor. Now, wand at the ready. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Remember, your wand is a conduit of your magic. Well, this will be a fun one. F. Base. Base. That wasn't so bad. We mastered it on the first try. Reparo. The mending term reparo can be used to mend broken objects and pieces of the environment. That'd be coming handy with a bridge. Awesome. That's it. Very good. If you would like to practice mending something, have a go with that broken statue in the alcove by the water. It allegedly symbolized heartbreak. Perhaps a jilted lover thought it too accurate and lashed out. Repairer. Nicely done. Works like a charm, doesn't it? <laughs> dort, a dort. Okay, now we're done with that. Oh, well, the map. Ancient magic throw. Ancient magic. Let's track it. That'll be our next task. I love how when you try to go through doors, it slows you down. I really have oh. made a mess of things. Navigation skills. What am I missing? Pardon me, come through. <laughs> the armor. He was humming. Hello, looking 
for me? Yes, ma'am. Natty, I hope I haven't kept you waiting long. Not at all. Professor Weasley tells me that you need to go to Hogsbeat. You must be eager to have your own things again. And to see the village. I've been looking forward to it. Good. Shall we set off? I intend to give you a first-rate Hogsmeade experience. Do we get Butterbeer? I don't want to go if we don't get it. You heard me. <clears throat> I was glad Professor Weasley asked me to accompany you. Really? Yes. I had planned to extend an invitation to you myself. I thought you might enjoy a better be in the village. <laughs> the timing of Professor Weasley's owl was perfect. She said the magic word. I'm glad I picked. I cannot tell you how nice it is to get fresh oh, yeah. air after being cooped up in ancient rooms. <laughs> hey, Jay, Maybe thanks for the like, brother. Take it as an elective class, believe me. I believe you. I it up, brother. So I suppose you I not call it elective when your mother was the one who elected that you take it. Hogsmeade is beautiful this time of year. Everyone will tell you to visit at Christmas. But that's one of the few times of year I would rather be indoors. <laughs> not much for the cold, are you? Oh, I do not mind the cold so much, but it has taken some getting used to. How are you doing this evening, my friend? How the hell are you doing? Hopefully you're good. Oh, wait, over here. I often spot lacewing flies in this area. Oh, what's so special about them? They are interesting to look at, but if you stew them, you can also use them in potion making. <laughs> they make funny noises. That's awesome. Look, from the forbidden forest, hippogriffs. I wonder if something startled them. I heard rumors that hippogriffs had been spotted nearby. Yeah, I hope so. That's our mounts. Absolutely. Our freebie mounts. But we gotta get so far in the game. It's off limits to students, as the name implies. Why is it off limits? The professors claim it is too dangerous. I think that calling it forbidden only makes it more alluring. Ah, there's Hogsmeade over the crest. Past that ruin. I see it. I would spend all of my time exploring if I could. I confess, I was surprised when Professor Weasley mentioned that you knew the area. Since you're relatively new. I'm playing here. day one, she Canada. Forgot. Awesome, brother. Mm. She knows more about me than I have. It is a good server. I will say. That's where you'll meet your. You learn a great deal in class. Much can be gleaned Her. outside of the castle. I, I, I saw a mushroom. I had to pick it. Toadstool caps. I like this game. So far, I'm digging it, man. How are you uh, settling in? It's a nice I remember the change of pace. followed my arrival feeling quite strange. Everything was so new and unfamiliar. I'm the lake. Used to things. The lake's what this way. You? You Let's go for yourself? a swim. I still miss my homeland, but it is beautiful here too. And looking out of the castle and exploring helped me to adjust quite a bit. Hogwarts has become something of a home now, Sorry. I would say. I saw Hopefully a squirrel. It will for you too. I'm liking it. It's awesome, man. This game's good. Like I said, Mr. nice Lord. change of pace. He's I love Hogwarts it. Caretaker. Looks a bit worse for wear. Hello, Mr. Moon. Have you met our new fifth year? Pleasure. Um, you might want to turn back, Miss On I. Uh, turn and run. Is everything all right, sir? 
Oh, it looked right at me. Eyes big as saucers. Yeah, too what many butterbees. Jimmy, guys, Dougley and Arian, mm, terrifying. I shall be at the castle where it's safe. Good luck to both of you. Poor Mr. Moon, a demigeist. I think he had too much fun in the village. I will say that I have never seen him in such a state. Nearly there. There is much to see outside of the castle walls, not just Hogsmeade. I am happy to explore whenever you'd like. Rumors being what they are about goblins and such, it might be nice to have a friend with you. I'll keep that in mind, Natty. Thank you. We made it. And here we are. It is hard to know where to start. Another the kitty cat. Sticks is the place for butter beer. And you can get any sweet you can imagine at Honey Dukes. I could not choose a favorite shop here. It changes with every visit. I can tell you that you are certain to find everything you need in Hogsmeade. Everything, huh? <laughs> Even sleeping women under steep. Professor Weasley said that you need to get potion recipes, spellcrafts, some seeds, and... A new wand. Of course. You will enjoy Mr. Ollivander, and I am keen to see what you will do with a wand of your own. You should be able to collect everything you need and still have time to explore a little as well. Experience Hogsmeade at your own pace. We can meet up in the town circle when you are finished. Enjoy yourself. I will see you soon. Wonder what she's up to. Alright, the map. Where do we want to go? Ollivander. Tome and Scrolls. Well, we are right here, so. Let's get our sh new shenanigan. Get our wand. It is right here. Merlin's blooming beard, not again. Uh oh, I found twenty nine gold. You don't I'll have right to touch it. Ah, it's you. Um, oh, gee, we said. Just a moment, please. Like he knew I was coming. Uh, sneaky, sneaky. Hello, I'm looking for, for a new wand. Yes. It's about time. Yes, uh, about time. Well, you're our new fifth year student, are you not? Oh, what am I saying? Of course you are. Gerbold Ollivander's the name. But of course, you'll have heard of the Ollivanders, I'm sure. Finest wand makers in the world. It's a pleasure to meet you, truly. Now, come with me. Let's find you the perfect one, shall we? Mm, uh, no, 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 not you. Um, He's going to give us a dangerous yes, one. Watch. Yes. Mm, powerful core. Ten and a half inches. Mm, you might do. Here, give this one a try. Well, go ahead, swish. Uh oh. Just bark. Oh, how odd. Uh, once more, come on, really swish it. Swish. Oh, dear. Oh, that one didn't like us. Well, this isn't a good match at all, is it? <laughs> uh, um, we'll find you something, not to worry. Mm. No, not you. Uh, uh, hmm. Perhaps... Yes. A rare wood, 13 and 3 quarter inches, dragon heart string. Let's give this one a try. Ooh, that one's pretty. <laughs> Another bad one. Looks like it's back to the shelf for you. <laughs> uh, 
This You'll is figure. proving to be trickier than I had anticipated. How perplexing. Um, where are you? He's a Perhaps perplexing. You? Uh, ah, you. you are. Hiding in a box yes. way up on top. I think you might be the one. Here, take it. Swish it. Swish it good. Wood tape. L'Oreal. Color type. Unicorn hair. Flexibility. Swishy. It has a unicorn here. Is the court? One style. Curious indeed. Ooh. How intriguing. I like that one. I like that one too. That one's kind of cool. Curious indeed. I think I like that one the best. That color. Intriguing. Curious indeed. Un Curious indeed. That's what I think. Unbe Phoenix feather or dragon's heart or unicorn here. Dragon's heart string that serves as a score of the one known of producing powerful magic. The hair of the unicorn that serves as a score of the one known for producing constant magic. Feather of the phoenix, the severe core of the one capable of producing a great range of. Powerful magic. Do we want the dragon or the phoenix? If we do phoenix, that means we have a great range. Or we'd be powerful. Ah, phoenix hmm. feather. Exceptionally rare. And a core with a strong sense of initiative. Okay, I think I like it. I think we like that one. What do you think? It is bonded. Another, bond, another beginning of a bright and magical future. <laughs> ah. Now, how did that feel? Good. Amazing. Different. I sense a sort of surge of some kind. A match. 
Your connection seemed particularly powerful. The right wand will learn from you, just as you learn from it. I'm eager to try it out. Of course. And a Phoenix Feather Core is terribly selective. This will be an excellent match indeed. And the bond between you and your wand should only grow stronger. Do not stronger, be surprised at your new wand's ability to perceive your intentions, particularly in a moment of need. That sounds wonderful, Mr. Ollivander. I'll let you get to it. Do come and see me again, if ever I can be of further assistance. Thank you, sir. All right, now we gotta go. Ocean job. On to the potion jab we go. Welcome to J. Pippin's potions. Pardon me, sir. Oh, thank goodness. When I heard the bell, I thought you were Miss Lawang. Not that she deigns to come here. Though, I don't believe I've seen your face here before, either. It's my first time in Hogsmeade, actually. Is it really? Well, Parry Pippin at your service. And this is J. Pippin's Potions. Potions for all ailments. <laughs> You'll have read it on the sign, of course, but Grandfather always made me say it in full. <laughs> How may I help you today? Professor Weasley sent me to collect some recipes. I'm new at Hogwarts. You're the student she sent the owl about. I set your things aside immediately. I suspected if you're anything like I was at your age, you'd want your potion supplies. Is it not the most fascinating art, potion making? Rivals anything you can do with a wand, I've always said. Are potions really that versatile? They may not be as showy as spell work, but make no mistake, they are just as powerful. They can heal, destroy, protect. You'll discover all of this soon enough. Just as, as powerful. First time in, I should mention that it's not just potion recipes I sell. I also offer ready-made drafts for all manner of uses, and I unveil new ones from time to time. Pop in when you can so you don't uh, miss out on anything. Hmm? But for now, let's get you those recipes, shall we? What can I do for you today? Feel free to take a look at the rest of my inventory. Or come back another time if you're in a rush today. Don't have no money to buy none of it. I can purchase one of those. Aids and healing restores a bit of drinker's health. Okay. Well, we got one potion. So we got potions we needed and we spent a little bit of money now we needed something else what else did we need <coughs> <coughs>
We can fast travel here now. Yay. Well, hello there. Pardon me, sir. I'm here for the seeds Professor Weasley arranged for me to collect. Oh, the Dittany for the new fifth year. <laughs> I take it that's you, then. Merlin's beard. Starting Hogwarts is a fifth year. You must be positively reeling from it all. Not at all. I'm choosing to see it all as one big adventure. Well, bravo. Not everyone has the temperament to take things as they come. Name's Timothy Teasdale, by the way. And this is my shop, the Magic Neep. I keep the cart out here because I like a good chat. Can't very well be in the thick of things if I'm hidden away inside now, can I? I suppose not. In addition to seeds, I have plenty of plants. Grow everything myself. My speciality is potion ingredients. Even Pippin purchases from me. But what say we get you a packet of Dipney seeds? Dipney seeds, that's all we needed. Let me guess, you're after something fresh. Do have a look around. Plenty of ingredients to pique your interest, I'd wager. I can pick all that stuff and sell it to you. Uh oh. I done screwed it. I saw something. I was a squirrel. Head at a pub. That's where we need to go. <laughs> That's not where we need to be. Three broomsticks, that's where we needed to go. Another cat. We always gotta have time to pet the Roman kitties. Might give us good luck.
Must be the back door. Yeah, we got in trouble we can get ourselves into. Uh, locked door. That ain't doing no good. What? Can't, can't control this camera very well. That's going to be the downfall. Found a potion. Quidditch glove. Is it tomes and scrolls? Okay, we gotta go tomes and scrolls. I was having fun exploring around. An inquiring mind. Pardon me, sir. I'm here for the spellcrafts Professor Weasley ordered. Matilda, student. I thought I might be seeing you soon. I am the proprietor here. Thomas Brown. I take it you've had a conjuring lesson then? I'm afraid I haven't yet, sir. Ah, but you will soon enough. It is magic at its purest, creating something out of nothing. Of course, it is not without complexity, but that is where my spellcrafts come in. Stay the course, and you could soon impress even Professor Weasley. That's certainly something to aspire to, Mr. Brown. I look forward to that day. And I, too, seeing it. Spellcrafts are incredibly useful for conjuring unique items like custom pieces of furniture or decoration. But I shall let Professor Weasley do the teaching. For now, let's get the spellcrafts you need. A potting table and a potion station, yes? I believe so, sir. Good. Nothing like being able to grow your own ingredients and brew what you want, when you want. Let's have a look. Let's, Let's have a look, look at what Jim. we have, shall we? Well, we need a little bit of that. And a little bit of that. If you're interested, feel free to take a look around at the rest of my inventory. No, well, we don't that's need everything. that yet. Better go and find Natty. Well, looky, looky, we found a hidden bookcase. Darling Luke.
Let's go meet Natty. Our adventurous. There she is. Ah, I have everything. I see what you meant about not being able to pick a favorite shop. <laughs> we should walk around a bit more. Perhaps today is the day I finally pick one. Oh yes, yeah, you're gonna pick a favorite chest. It's a troll. Get our own troll. Is he not getting out of the way? Oh, he's going to kill me. It's going to kill me. Potion. it fast enough. Goodness, a second troll. Did you two take on a fully grown troll by yourselves? I suppose so. It's all a bit of a blur, to be honest. Merlin's beard. Are you all right? We are. 
Custom graphics, help. man. I'd say help is I think a bit I'm good in that department, but thanks for the Don't looking out. That. Appreciate you. The makings of an aura, if you ask me. If you are unharmed, perhaps the two of you wouldn't mind helping me put a few things back to where they were. Of course, officer. Singer. Officer Singer. And thank you, again. <clears throat> oh, yeah. Saved our biscuits. Oh, hello there. A, a moment, if you would. I will see what he wants. Hmm. What was that? Lumos. Peru. Repair it. Lucky they didn't do more damage. Bear it. They will come. One more to repair. Oh, this little thing right here. Repair. Speak with the shopkeeper. We're just talking about you. I'm glad I could come. Hello, sir. I don't believe we've met. Allow me to just introduce in the nick myself. Of time. Augustus Hill, Clothier Extraordinaire. I should like to thank you for your remarkable bravery in fighting those trolls, and not to mention your help restoring Hogsmeade to its rightful state. I was happy to help. Frankly, you deserve an Order of Merlin. But I can offer you something much more useful. Much I more. I own Gladrag's wizard wear, and among my inventory are some unique items that afford certain protections, as it were. Life-saving protections. And as I suspect this won't be your last dangerous encounter, I'd like to give you one such set of robes. In thanks for what you did today. Thank you, sir. Thank you, Mr. Hill. That's very generous of you. It's the least I can do. Uh, now, uh, let's try this on for size, shall we? Plenty for your perusal today. Take your time. Temporarily unavailable. Time to equip it. Go to the gear screen. Your current defense and offense are displayed at the top right of the screen. Health, 235. Defense, offense, 0, zero. <laughs> Of course, we got nothing. Select a cloak and robes gear slot and press the button. Offense five. 
off at the time. Equip offense zero. Darrowing cloak well appointed. Not upgrade. Sell value. 60. Well appointed. Pretty slick. Five hundred defense. Legendary. Oh, look at us. What an extraordinary introduction to Hogsmeade. I would say that we, and you in particular, have earned at least one butterbeer. Shall we head to the three broomsticks? Sounds like a good idea. Wonderful. Just down this way, then. I sell even more battle-worthy items, should you be inclined. You're most welcome to peruse my shop at your leisure. Revelio. We need a death, but we is out of potion. Rebellion. Assuming it is not too busy, you might even meet Serona, the owner. She is a charming hostess and a powerful witch. Good one to know. Powerful, she says. Good to know. You said you could get to the Chard when they came to Hogsmeade. That all you needed was a distraction. I gave you a distraction. I just watched a student take down your distraction. Who is this child? What are you not telling me? All you need to know is that if you cannot get to the Chard, then you have no value to me. Let's go. Did they see us? I don't think so. What was that goblin doing with Victor Rookwood? Vanrock is working with Rookwood. The goblin from the Daily Prophet. I knew I'd seen him somewhere. Quickly, let's get inside the three broomsticks. Quickly, before we get spotted. It's a treat to see you, Lord Gok. I shall let you know if I hear anything. Thank you, Serona. You be well. You be well, Serona. Now, what can I... Oh. There's a face I haven't seen before. <laughs> it's my first time here. Welcome. Butterbeer's on me. Heard about the attack. I shall be looking in on the other shopkeepers and residents shortly. Glad to see you have escaped injury. Thanks we get to, to Butterbeer. Single-handedly took down a troll. Is that right? Well done. Thanks for this. My pleasure. I will say, <sighs> trolls in Hogsmeade. That's never happened before. Something's not right. The only brutes we usually have to deal with are... <coughs> uh, uh, Oh, time lane. Those came. Was that Lodgok I saw leaving just now? <laughs> Your clientele's not what it used to be, Serona. Not to worry, Victor. Once the two of you leave, the caliber of my clientele will greatly improve. 
I wouldn't do that if I were you, Theophilus. Come now. No need for theatrics. I'm only here for this one anyway. My friend is enjoying a well-earned butterbeer. Only want a quick word. Perhaps you didn't hear me. Interrupting the beard. My friend is busy. One would think you all had enough bloodshed for one day. Come, Theophilus. The three broomsticks isn't what it used to be. Let's take our galleons elsewhere. Can't drink butter beer forever. Seems like <laughs> an unfortunate enemy. Watch your back. Rookwood and Harlow are worse than any troll you might encounter. Trolls, Ranrock, and Rookwood. What are you not telling me? I promise to tell you everything. But it's perhaps best I do that later. Later. Much later. I think that now might be a good time to head back to the castle. Might be a good time to head back to the castle, she says. Wait for me! You tricky brood. I am certainly glad Serona was there. And that she isn't intimidated by thugs like Brookwood and Harlow. I want to understand what's going on, and I hope you will tell me. But for the moment, we should return to the castle. Professor Weasley will certainly hear about the troll attack soon if she hasn't already. I don't want her to worry. Troll attacks, she says. You must return to the common room for the night. Access the map. Okay. Back to the castle. Hogwarts. Common room. Great hall. South wing. Grand staircase. Astrology. Library. Bell tower. Exit. Bell tower? Hmm. Oh, that ain't it. Both wing. Ravenclaw common room. There we go. We will fast travel there. Right where we're supposed to be. And we took our nighty night. Quest complete. We are level four. Plus 20 hit points. Oh, look, we got an owl. New quest available. Hogs need. Come see me. I've discovered something in the locket. We can found out the trigger knots. Okay. Talk to Professor Fig. Let's just be sneaky and fast travel there, shall we? We just 
fast travel across the castle. Of course it is. She's right. Thank you. Well, it's their own fault for saving it. And then letting it grow fond of them. What else are they supposed to do with it? Ugh. They should go catch fire to the place. Professor Fig. I'm here. Guess we have to wait for him to show up. What a turd. There he is. Professor, I'm glad to see you. And I, you. Thank Merlin you're in one piece. I heard about the attack. Trolls in Hogsmeade? Sir, the trolls were wearing armor. It had that dark glow, like the dragon collar. Goblin silver! Ranrock used it to control the dragon. But how? Look at that. And why send trolls to? They were there because of me. I overheard Ranrock talking with Victor Rookwood. Ranrock was in Hogsmeade with Rookwood. The trolls were Ranrock's distraction so that Rookwood could get to me. And he would have had Serona and the patrons at the Three Brumsticks not intervened. This is great news indeed. If Ranrock's goblins and dark wizards are after you, they want what we found in that vault. Who wants the locket? Speaking of the vault, do you think that Ranrock is working with any of the goblins at Gringotts? I do not. Gringotts goblins aren't typically the friendliest of beings, but they have a great deal of integrity. No, I dare say after what happened to that poor banker, the goblins at Gringotts are no followers of Ranrock. Hmm. They're after the locket. They want you my locket. You said you discovered something in it. Yes, yes. I discovered an inscription. When I read it aloud, this map appeared. Clever enchantment. It's a map of Hogwarts, to be sure. But I do not know where it leads. It leads to the library. A restricted section, to be precise, and a bit beyond. I see traces of magic there on the map. I suspected you would see something. Shall we go? I appreciate your enthusiasm, and I'm eager to discover what we may find there as well. But if our experience at Gringotts, let alone what happened to Miriam, taught me anything, it's that the path we're on is terribly dangerous. I'd like you to work with Professor Hecker. Terribly a bit dangerous. Before we continue. But, sir, how dangerous could the library be? Perhaps we're only after a book. Perhaps we are only after a book. But we should be prepared for anything. Once you've honed your defensive magic further, come and see me. I'll let Professor Hecker know to expect you. Quest complete. The Lacket Secret. All right. Off on another adventure. Urge defending Hogsmeade against trolls. You know, there is such a thing as trying too hard. Too hard, he said. Level four. Report to Professor Hikat. Incendio is our reward. Guess we'll track it. Talk to look better, Libby. I should speak with looking better to be about the secret dueling club. I bet you have something like Fight Club. But <laughs> with wands. How oh, amazing. <sighs> we need. 
that one to go to this one. Probably should do that one too. Navigate around all these NPCs. Revelio. Lucan's just over there. Can I help you? Sebastian told me to see you about a club. If Sebastian vouches for you, that's all I need to know. I coordinated duels, need it, huh? crossed ones. A dueling club of sorts. It's invitation only, so you must have really impressed Sebastian. I seem to have a knack for dueling. Then you've come to the right place. How does cross wands work exactly? You show up, I match you with other duelists, and whoever is still standing in the end wins. It's our way of determining the school's greatest duelist once and for all. And to liven things up, the winner is awarded a prize. Interested? Of course. Dueling's an entertaining pastime. I agree. Besides, in cross ones, you can duel with a partner if you like. Your first time I'll pair you with Sebastian. Next time, you'll need to bring a partner along or duel alone. So, care to step into the ring? Get me in the ring. Spectacular! Let the fireworks begin! Fireworks, he says. We'll make you regret signing up. <laughs> Cap locks. Let you track your enemy. Okay. And Gringo. Potato. Ah, 
shield. As defeated. No. That looks painful. Care to try another round? Well, let's do it one more time. Yes. Don't count me out yet. Brilliant. Victory. Big hit, was about to meet the maker. Nice work. Sebastian <laughs> wasn't wrong about you. There's strong competition ahead, but keep this up and you could be the next school champion. Brilliant. Yeah. Count me in. I shall. Now, it takes time to organize these duels, but check with me later. I may have something lined up for you. Again, congratulations on your first crossed ones victory. Well fought. Well fought. Hope to see you back here again. We completed the round one. Cross wands. Ooh, we're almost level five. Report to Professor. Okay. Enough playing around. Let's go. Hello? I feel sorry for your next opponent. <laughs> as you should chick as you should this is pretty the ray tracing oh look at that beautiful You guys are only seeing it in 1080p, but I'm, I see it in 1440. A little prettier. Oh, we gotta go this way. What? What do we got here? Oh, just a globe. Just a globe. Rebellion. Help me with my sad predicament. Uh oh, side quest. Stay clear of the side quests. She's in a predicament. Sad. Ah, I'm here about the new spell you wanted to teach me, Professor. Good. Uh, Professor Fig indicated a certain urgency to you completing your defensive magic assignments. 
As such, you are to learn Incendio, the fire-making spell. Handy for lighting torches, burning away spider webs, and, when necessary, defending against those who would wish to do us harm. Sounds uh, versatile. Versatile. But Sound. before we get started, I'd like you to complete a few tasks. You may be surprised by some of them. Astonishing how much students don't think their professors know. When you're finished, come and see me. Then we shall begin working on Incendio. Incendio. You know where to find me once you've finished. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna go find what you need. Seems to be the story. Win two rounds of the cross wands. Round two. Win two rounds of cross one. Wait around and still foundation practice. Yeah, okay. Let's do that again. See what we have in our inventory. A letter to fig from black. Got a little little spill. Check out our gear. Our little one. Nothing selected. Offense lower. Might as well equip them. Center, right? Check here. No defense. I have offense nine and defense four. And we got a goofy looking hat. All right. Let's go win another duo, shall we? Seems crossed ones isn't as secret as it's believed to be. All of my siblings have finished at Hogwarts. Okay. We 
Yep. And back over here. Ready for another round? I think so. We shall see who shows up. There's no one in the school I'd be afraid to duel. I know, Sebastian. I know. Glad you're back. Hello, Lucan. Is the next round of Crossed Ones all set? Why, yes it is. I've got a great match lined up. Ready for another round? <laughs> Reveal you. <laughs> As exploring. I'm ready. Let's do it. Brilliant. Are you Brilliant. Doing partner? Yes, Natty. Then let's get to it. Natty. Ready to get thrashed? My dirty little Natty. Apologies in advance. Who is three against two? What's this? Defeated. Kept it in the wrong name, but. Glad I didn't bet on you that round. Catch, go again. I'll give it another go. We'll That's give her moment. another go. Yeah, yeah. Defeated again. That uh, Q button is not very responsive. Again? Why not? I'll give it another go. Glad to hear it. Let me 
shield. There goes my way. Let me open. Come on. Pretty good. Stupid one. Oh, we got defeated again. Well, practice makes perfect, right? Catch yeah. Again? I'll give it another go. Well, I gotta do it. Gotta beat it. <laughs> <laughs> Break through violet shields with force builds like the summoning charm. <laughs> Defeat it again. There we go. Why do I keep hitting the wrong button? <coughs> Care to go again? We're gonna beat him. I'll give it another go. Glad to hear it. Round five. Probably should change up my spells. Get them other ones out of there. Let's see. No, we don't want that. Well, we can't do it now. We did pretty, pretty Can't good. Go again? We knocked one out. I think I'd better rest for a bit. Very Got well. It. We'll be waiting when you're ready. Get this crap off my bar, man. Let me see what we got here. Okay, so we got everything on there. That we can put up there.
Just gotta hit the right combo nation. Alright, let's do another trip. Let's do it. Hello, Lucan. Is the next round of Cross Swans all set? Why, yes, it is. I've got a great match lined up. Ready to redeem yourself? I'm ready. Let's do it. Brilliant. Are you dueling with a partner? Yes, Natty. Then let's get to it. Ready to get thrashed? Apologies in advance. Ah. Ravelli. Akio. We did pretty good that time. I'll give it another go. Glad to hear it. There we go. We got him. Some big hit that round. Yay. Seven times a charm, baby. Bravo. <laughs> I gave it my all. You did. I miss you missed a lot of fun. A lot of dueling. I'll round, tell you that. They'll really have it That's in for you. That's what you missed. You'd better keep practicing if you want a chance of winning <laughs> or at least surviving the next round. I'll let you know when we're ready. Hope to see you then. Yay. The next round is for all the gobstones, so to speak. All the gobstones. We finally did it. Woot woot. I tell you what, that was fun. Trick. Completed a round of spell combination practice with Lucas Battery. Okay.
Hello, Lucan. May I use the training dummy? Of course. I'll fetch it and give you a list of combinations to practice. Ready to have a try now? I am. That would be wonderful. Be sure to cast all your spells before the dummy lands. If you need to stop practicing before you finish all of them, let me know. Let me know. Accio! Excellent fall! Let me open. Done. Oh, wrong button. Keep trying. Fabulous. Okay, that's enough practice. You looked good out there. Thank you, Lucan. I say better to discover one's weaknesses during practice than during a duel. You'll be a fearsome challenger now. Fearsome. Assignment's all finished. Woohoo, we hit level five. We're getting there. We're getting to be the big dog. All right, let's go get our spill. Let's get that spill. You got this. Yeah, we got it, brother. Rebellion. Excuse me, coming through. Coming through again. Beautiful game. They did good detail. I'm impressed with it. What do you think? Look good? Because it's going to look, I guess. Might some kind soul help me? No. Your side quest. You side chick. We don't want no part of you. Not right this moment. I Go trust on. Mr. Brattleby was able to accommodate you and that you... I finished all of the tasks you gave me, Professor Hackett. Glad to hear it. Then Give you me should my be spill. ready to learn Incendio. Should be, Professor. Yes. I'm sorry to say I visited enough careless colleagues at St. Mungo's to assure you that Fire is a fickle servant. Your spellcasting has impressed me thus far, but please maintain focus. Maintain I would rather we not focus. end today's lesson with your robes aflame. Let us begin. <laughs> what, and remember, what? focus Get on the proper wand on, movement. Concentrate and keep your wand steady. This is hard. Hard with the uh, mouse keyboard. Oh, we made it. We got it. New spell unlocked. T T T for new spell. Yes. Actually. Put that there. And repair over there. One, two, three. One, two, three. Make life a little bit easier. Yeah. Just a little bit easier. And feet are the same. Yeah. 
<laughs> Incendio. You're getting it. Keep at it. And do try not to incinerate yourself. <laughs> Yeah, like a... Setting things ablaze is certainly cathartic, isn't it? Yes. Yes, it is. <clears throat> it makes me happy. It makes me happy when it rains. No, 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 no. No sad predicaments. Not right now. We got spills to learn. Places to go. That used to watch because they're watching us. Yeah, no, all that good stuff. Ugh, Ugh she says in disgust as I walk by. She was jealous my hat was cool. I already know. Plus there's a stinking chest tree. Where the heck is Revelio? Tony. Professor Fig, I am here. Ah, there you are. I was waiting for you. Where else would I? Hello, sir. You'll be pleased to know Where that I you? worked on my defensive magic with Professor Hackett. So I hear. She tells me you've taken rather well to your new wand. You must continue to work with her and your other professors to improve your skills. That said, I don't wish to postpone our visit to the library any longer. Any longer. So, shall we proceed? Fig, I have work for you. Come. Headmaster, I'm with a student and my schedule Your schedule will wait indefinitely, as will your student. I would think that after all the trouble you caused me with Osric, you'd be eager to make amends. Uh oh My office, five minutes. He wants us to make amends. That man is exasperating. Unfortunately, our trip to the restricted section will have to wait a bit longer. But, Professor... We have no choice. It would be unwise to provoke our illustrious headmaster further. I shall find you when I've completed whatever toils I must endure. Hey boy. We're on the next little adventure. Crash test dummy up there. <laughs> Why? Why Sebastian crash mentioned dummy? sneaking into the restricted section. Perhaps he'll have an idea. Perhaps. <laughs> we will find out. Getting pretty. Sebastian, there you are. I was hoping to see you. I was in the three broomsticks after the troll attack and saw what happened with Rookwood and Harlow. Not many students have Victor Rookwood's attention. What was that all about? I've never even met him. Perhaps he mistook me for another student. If you say so. I won't press you now, but you will have to tell me what's going on at some point. You might need me. So, why were you looking for me? I need to find something for Professor Fig, but it's in the restricted section of the library. <laughs> he can't get it himself? He was called away by Black at the last moment. 
I suppose I could wait to get a note from him, but... You want to show some initiative. Precisely. You mentioned being clever enough not to get caught in the restricted section. And I am. Meet me outside the library tonight, and tell no one. Thank you, Sebastian. I'll meet you later. We'll meet you later. No, it's later. We're in trouble. See there? That's the door we need to reach. And those annoying prefects would love nothing more than to rat on us to Scribner. So don't let them see us. Understood? I can be sneaky. Let's go. Hold on now. There's a spell you should know. The disillusionment charm. Good for getting places you're not supposed to be. Cast it and you'll appear as little more than a trick of the light. Just as long as you keep your distance and stay quiet. You mean I'll actually be able to turn invisible? Something like that. It's not as foolproof as a cloak, but those are expensive. And spells, spells are free. Give it a try. Oh boy. Got it. Give me that. Right. Quiet now. still here. Quick, behind the bookcase. All right, where do we got to go? We got to go that way. be gone by now I said usually but it'll still be all right do you see her desk behind me the key is in the drawer of that desk now here's what we're going to do I'll create a distraction to draw her away you focus on getting the key I'll meet you outside of the restricted section you distract I get the key understood I said I'd get you in and I always keep my word trust me Better not be a student in here. It's after hours.
The key. Here it is. Is some of them? Must have been one of the books wandering about. Must have been one of the books. Yeah, we're in the restricted section. Down, down, down. Use basic cast while undetected to lure 30 figures and enemies to a desired location. I think I already did that. Well, thanks for letting me know I can do it. Ghost, don't let her see you. Should be in the clear now. No need for us to be skulking about. Silent as a grave. So what is it you've been looking for? I'm looking for a cure to help my twin sister, Anne, so that she can return to Hogwarts. Because Merlin knows everyone else has given up. Why do you think we'll find a cure in the restricted section? Does the Hogwarts matron have nothing that can help Anne? No. We've tried everyone from Nurse Blaney to St. Mungo's. But I can research on my own. No Say need to mongoose. concern yourself with that right now. <laughs> Let's focus on what you're after. Which is what, precisely? I'll know it when I see it. You're being awfully cryptic. Secrets of the darkest arts. I'm impressed. Rebellion. shouldn't be. No. Naughty, naughty. You'll get caught. Peeves, don't you. I'm going to tell. I'm going to tell. I'm going to tell. <laughs> oh, blasted Peeves. I've got to stop him or at least get to the librarian with a good excuse for all of this. Wait, I don't want you getting into trouble for me. I have a way with the faculty when it comes to disciplinary matters. Besides, I like having friends who are in my debt. Now go. Good luck in your search. Good luck. Now, where has that damned poltergeist got to? I know just the spell to repair this armor. Ooh, looks like a you know what. Repair on. Dreamers Nightwear. It's a nightwear. Whew. 
creepy. Of course, traces of ancient magic. That's it. Investigate. Ancient magic. My butt. Sunrise route. Where might this lead? Uh oh. Lead to a cut screen. Means we're loading into something. Power. Ah, I need to wake up that rune over there. Get up. Not surprising. Guards at the ready. Wicked. No. Uh -oh. Ancient magic accumulates by successfully attacking and taking damage. Ooh, look at us. We got ancient magic in us. When at least one of the segments of your ancient magic meter is full, you can cast devastating ancient magic attacks that deal massive damage and break shield charm. Tap X when you see the prompt over an enemy's head. Love it. I love it. All right. <clears throat> New ancient magic. Love it. Oh boy. We got no potion. Oh my gosh, be careful. Protego, stupid one. Stupefy. He fell down before I completed the spell. I'm talking about. Whoa, 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 killer. Whoa. You gotta be quick. Whew. Look at that floor. Isn't that pretty? I'm telling you. I get this amused by the forward, small thing. But to where?
Nearly there. Best keep my wits about me. Phew. Holy, look at that. We got a scarf. Check it out real quick. Scarf, scarf. Plus six offense. Well appointed. Oh, look at that. Fanciness. What else do we get? One. That's good. We rid. <laughs> Weird. We got ourselves a new outfit. Look at that. A little more. A little bit of underwear. <laughs> Did find a new robe. Sunrise robe, legendary. Offense seven. Worth a couple of pennies. Oh, look at that. It's pretty blue. Now we look like we're going to Nene. Plus 17 offense and 11 defense. We'll take it. We'll look at another one. Yeah, we got a stylish top. Mid. Plus 5 defense. Plus four even well appointed. That's better than that one. This one's superb three. That one's well appointed five. Okay. Now we're styling. Start wearing bathrobes. You know. Top hat. Or toast. You. Come here, boy. Incendio. Oh, that don't help it. Uh oh. They done threw me off. Oh, 
Oh. Ah, thanks for the light, buddy. Sheet. Incendio. Oh, yeah. What about the day again? <laughs> I need, uh, I need some potion. We get first, first three or four down. And Penalto Gaming, thanks for the light. All right. There. Next one. Incendio. Prepare. Shit. They threw me off. Very serious. Incendio. Protego. Repara. Accio. Jeez. Hey, both jump me. <laughs> I do need some health pots. Oh, Lord. All right, we get. Just got to get those tags down. Kill these guys quickly. All right. Oh, crap. Protego. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Every time I go to hit that shield, they hit me right before the shield activates. All right, we will get this. Got it that time. protects you when they jump in the sky like that that's tough without no healing pots need to keep stock keep them in my pocket all right too easy one back here Next. Next. Let me answer. Akio. Oh. 
Oh lord. These guys are miserably good. Okay. I think I'm getting tired. Oh, come on now. <clears throat> and I gotta do your follow through attack. They do more damage. But when you got three or four of them on you at a time, it makes your butt fucker just a little bit. Okay, yeah, these guys are easy because these pods explode. <laughs> I will get this. All right, AJ. Thanks, man. Appreciate you. So, Z, finish, three, Z, Isn't that helping? <laughs> All right, one more try, and I'm just going to call it a night. Try again tomorrow. Maybe I should just stay right here. Wrong button. Good lord. That's a bad button I have. That was no bueno. Incendio. <laughs> 
I kept hitting the freaking home button instead of Z. Freaking home button or the Windows button. Okay. Are you kidding me? All right, I give up. We are done for the night. Oh, yes. Oh, my. The end is he. I will see everybody on the next stream. Appreciate all the likes, all the new followers, you name it. Appreciate you all. Thanks again. We'll see you tomorrow.